Lisa and Golston, state leaders acknowledge they need to find a balance between protecting homeowners from price hikes while also figuring out ways that will incentivize insurers to do business in California. All key players involved could not get a deal done by the time this year's policymaking deadline for state lawmakers passed last week. And now state leaders say they have some new plans in the works. After the collapse of a legislative deal to salvage California's homeowners insurance situation, state lawmakers say it's back to the drawing board. This is an incredibly urgent issue. Assembly Speaker Robert Rivas announced lawmakers will hold special hearings this fall to get the public involved. We wanted a, 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 an ironclad guarantee that consumers were going to be you know, sure that they were protected uh, in any type of uh, you know, legislative effort. Leader of the state Senate, Tony Atkins, says getting out into the community will be important. I think we've got a lot of work to do with the community on what the issues are. I mean, we spent time talking to economists about, you know, the overall structure, and it isn't just a California problem. Other states and globally, this is an issue. How do you spread risk across all pools of people affected and fairly um, have people be able to get the policies they need? And that was the first indication for me, this was a few years ago, that this was a serious issue. Meanwhile, Governor Gavin Newsom has said his administration has its own effort underway, but he's not yet ready to share exactly what that includes. This is a fast moving, not slow moving issue. People are being dropped every single day. The insurance industry's message to California homeowners. Insurance companies want to write in California. California is a good state, but we do need tools that allow us to accurately predict that risk so we can accurately price it. Consumer advocacy groups say homeowners need to be protected. Having hearings around the state where the insurance companies go and talk about their issues aren't going to solve this problem. And paying whatever ransom the insurance companies want isn't going to solve the problem. Now, those legislative hearings in the fall are not yet scheduled, but the bottom line here is that discussions on how to handle this are ongoing. Back to you. All right, Ashley, thank you. California Insurance Commissioner Ricardo Lara says that changes in state law is one path state leaders can take. He says he's also looking at some regulatory changes that he can do on his own to help speed up the state's rate review process, which has frustrated insurance companies.